Underneath the concept of continuity of care, what that means is that people who are employees have the right to take a look at things with ease. The problem is that I want to ask you, do you really feel that a person who is a receptionist has a right to know what's going on with you medically more or faster than your own family? Do you really feel that a person who's in accounting has a right to know or gossip about what your illness might be? Do you really feel that a janitor who knows how to access the computer systems of your work or your uh, opportunities for you for employment in life has a right to take a look at your chart out of nosiness or spite. You see, the problem with the continuity of care program is that it doesn't bar people from their gossip during pillow talk at night. So everyone typically has a love partner or a group of people we call family of choice. And a lot of times people gather together to dine and they talk about their day to decompress. And when they do that, they might also talk to people in other parts of the hospital who might have nothing at all to do with your daily or hourly care. So what we've got are doctors and nurses and phlebotomists and x-ray technicians talking about the unique situations that they're handling in their job, which would be no different than any other person on the planet who has some sort of family that they care for and share their life with evermore. But my problem, of course, that you probably are starting to see is that what it means is we have no more privacy to what's going on with our bodies. 